So now I'm going to start talking about the iTunes Store, and this is where you can buy uh, digital downloads of music, movies, TV shows, music videos, audiobooks, uh, podcasts, which are mostly free, games, um, and just tons of other stuff. So first off, let me show you how to create an account. And there's a couple ways to do this. You can just click on Sign In, and then since you don't have an account, you can just hit Create New Account. If you did already have an Apple ID, uh, you could go ahead and enter that. And um, another way would be if you're just browsing around and you really decide you want to buy a song, when you click on that, you're going to have to enter your information. Well, let me show you how to create an account. So you'll get this little pop-up right here. Um, step one of three is to read through the, the term service. So if you read through this and you agree, you'll check right here. Hit continue. Next you'll see this step two of three, create an Apple account. And you'll want to enter your email address and then password, verify the password, enter in a security question. Let me just enter in a fake email I don't use. And verify the password. Um, question of some kind. You know, enter something in real, of course. Enter my birthday, and then you click if you want to receive the following email: new releases and additions to the iTunes Store, and the new special offers information related to services from Apple. Remember, these are the same two letters that you had the option to subscribe to when you downloaded iTunes. So think about that. I'll just hit continue. And then you're going to have to enter in your credit card information. Your card number, um, expiration date, security code on the back. Of course, select your, your card. And then you'll need to enter in the, the name that your bank has on file. So once you do all that, then you're set up to start buying uh, songs in the iTunes store. And um, it's going to ask you, pretty much every time you try to download something new, it'll ask you for your, your password and everything. Um, so you have to sign in like when you restart iTunes. So just remember to save your password and everything. And then later, if you need to... Um, uh, alter your account, you can do that as well. But that's how you uh, just create an account uh, for the iTunes store.